What is going on, dudes? Mouse the Gina. Welcome to Pokemon Ultra Sun Ultra Moon. So I just got back from the midnight release, and it's actually only 11:30. So they decided it was they they mentioned it was supposed to be uh, only it was supposed to be regional time, but he just he knows he mentioned how the cops in my city like to pull people over late night. So I wanted to show you guys before we started. I uh, wanted to show you this. This is the um. The actual game package, this is, has both of them in it, so it's thick, and it's very cool. So the bonus is it includes 16 art cards and in-game item codes for for 200 Pokeballs. Really? That's pretty dope. So, anyway, um, yeah, they don't say much about anything on this box. It's just got the main characters and the, the legendaries and the starters on the back, so pretty cool stuff. I'm going to use my knife real quick, and I'm just going to open this little bit of tape. Before I do that, I want to show you. This is what you got for pre-ordering in general. Look how beautiful this image is. You can't even see how gorgeous it is in the camera. And then you've got the back. It's all shiny. It's super shiny. Super sparkly and shiny, and it's got all the legendaries. So, very, very dope. Look at that, dude. We're going to be playing Pokemon Ultra Moon this time, because I did Sun last time, and I'm going to be doing a Ultra Sun Wonder Way lock, as well as, this will be the copy I used for the Wonder Soul Link I'm going to do with Brendan. It's pretty cool stuff. Uh, you don't know Brendan, I don't think. I don't think he's been in any videos, but... There's a bunch of them. It only showed the legendaries and Mewtwo on the front. Look at that. There's Mewtwo with a whole bunch of paint splashes, and it's got its information on the back. Even, like, that's awesome. Ho ho, I'm gonna just show you this. They all have their information in the back. Ho ho. Kyogre. I like I really like how that background looks. Groudon. Dialga. Palkia. I don't know why Giratina's not on here, but whatever. Reshiram. I love Reshiram. I love Reshiram. I have my I have the plus over there actually. Zekrom, who is also like dope as all hell. Xerneas. Eveltsol. Solgaleo. Lunala. And then it has, <clears throat> it shows you what the individual, like, diagrams for these guys look like. Same for Lunala. This is really dope, Act this this whole thing with the art pack and whatnot. Dust, dust form, lichen rock. There's also one of these, too. They don't have a bunch of art cards. That's really interesting that that is what they have here. So anyways... Um, yeah, I'm gonna boot up the, emu the, the viewer, the, the emulator, the viewer, and I'll be right back. This is my 3DS, by the way, so you know that I'm, this is the one that has a little port, so I can actually use it, that's the charger port. This one right there, that one's how I view it. Anyways, I just wanted to show you that it's not an emulator. I'm talking in my sleep, this story won't stop me, and you feel sheer cold to me. Pretty sure this is different than the music they had in the first game. We're gonna begin the game in English. Settings have been saved, thanks. You have a message from the Yolo region's own Professor Kukui. Jeez, that took a while to load. The music is different. Wow. Hang on now, give me just a sec! Hey, good evening! Thanks, man. So the day has finally come, you're moving to Alola. Alola's a region made up of several islands. I know I got that beautiful picture down there. The graphics are like already, I can tell they're so much better. That could be the reason the reason chock full of nothing but rare Pokemon. Yeah, there's no such cool Pokemon out there in Alola either. You're gonna show me the, the rock rough? Such mysterious creatures. I can't wait to get my, my Lycan Rock. You find them all over in grass, cave, sky, and sea. You know, we love our Pokemon, we depend on them heaps, too. I don't think the Cutie Fly was there last time. So we even battle with them, we call ourselves trainers. Rock off, Cutie Fly, I'll play with you later. Cool your jets. It's cool you got a new Pokemon. I would right, ask you some questions, saying, so introduce you to everybody. Which form should I use for your trainer passport? Let's do it. So I really like I, the female character in this game. Is so much better than the one in the first game. So I'm actually, once again, I'm gonna go with the. When do we get to change our hair color? Cause I want the the blue eyes for Alilia. Let's do it. We got Alilia. No, that's how it was. Cause oh, Oli, Olili, 
Uh. Okay, cool. Ah, ten four, good buddy. I'll let everyone out know you're on your way. Olivia! Yeah, that's the name. It hits you like drop kick right to the head. Woo! Can't wait to see a person there, cousin. So I guess, are we a new person moving to Alola? That's, that's interesting. Lily, you come help me with these boxes. This intro is very similar to how the first one was. Is the cutscene with, with Lily going to be the same? This is an alternate timeline. This time you can actually see Cosmog's face in that. Who are those? What? I actually don't know who those are. Wow. That's dope. I'm so excited. I literally only know that the all the all the leaders are back and you get to fight them. I, it's probably going to be post game. Um it's actually night. I guess it has kind of has to be because that's how the original game was. What am I um it should be daytime though because of how late I'm playing this. That time it's in it's in a little Persian and not a rock rough, and it's a girl, a different sprite for the girl trainer. How can anything be more soothing? I love the text bubbles. The first thing you spin on Lilith's calm when I figured I could stay out here all night. That's enough of that. Time to pack these boxes. Me off, go get a Lilia for me, would you? That's actually really cool It's straight away, you know it's a different timeline. Because of that whole thing, beginning, it's still a Cosmog. I wonder if the room is actually blue if you are if you choose a male character. What is that? There's like a signature thing over there. It's a Snorlax this time. What was it last time? Was it a Clefairy? That's a signature of someone. There's our character. I want to. I want. I. The only reason I chose this one is because the blue eyes. Because the original. What kind of noise was that? <laughs> I got an Eevee on my bedspread. All right. I love, dude. I love how everything looks, actually. And look at that. Save it's his own option at the bottom. Whoa. Autograph, you got it from Jim Leonard Canto. They wrote, good luck. It's gotta be blue. I think it's blue. It's game console. You can even stay, take outside and play their plug in their own game. The Switch there. That's not an excursion. It's bad. Ruminously comfy. You could waste your whole life lazy in battle one. It doesn't look like it. It doesn't look like it's sync. So, I mean, there could be the whole thing that this is... And it's on a pedestal this time. Whoa. It's the new coat rack your mom bought for you. I don't have to get my things? Okay, sure. Like, you could tell the graphics are improved. I might have a little bit of lag because I'm on an original 3DS XL. You're like a light, weren't you? You gotta be full of energy by now. And look, night's already here. It's coming to the opposite of Kanto. But then we are so far away here in Alola. Oh, you're excited to meet some Alolan Pokemon? Yeah, I am. That's right, I want to hurry up and meet some, too. We're living in Lola now. The beautiful islands everyone wants to visit. I'm sure Pokemon living in a place like this must be friendly, right? Might not be a bad idea to go out and see for yourself how friendly Pokemon are, right? Get ready for a bit of exploring. Your bagging hat and things should be on your coat stand. And adventure rules. I don't need the adventure rules. I played Pokemon for freaking 15 years, bro. It's actually probably been like 14, but that's a long-ass time. The facial models were still kind of pixely, but 
Although I think it, the game so far looks great. It looks a bit better on the smaller screen. Now you look ready for everything. Or anything, whatever. But even so, try to be careful walking in the grass. I have to be I love to have Pokemon. Why don't you head up at Iki Town so you can discover? She's telling me everything what to do and I don't even need Kukui. That's right, get wrecked, Kukui. Mumbo of a surfboard, she bought it from Kanto. The blue eyes, that's Puka. Puka evolved at some point. See your dad's car. Mom brought along so she could use it to run errands. There's no space for a car in Alola. Or in any Pokemon game, really. Just look how pretty this is! I'm so excited! I really hope it lives up to the hype that I have for it. Because it's like... <sighs> the first game has really disappointed me. Dude, this is gorgeous. That was... What was that? Was that an Eon Pokemon? Or was that just a Murkrow? We'll do the same thing. It's a Murkrow. Okay. I was thinking I saw an E on a Pokemon. I'm like, what? You can go with me, V Dash. What do you think of my song? Whoa. I actually love this. is gorgeous. This game is gorgeous. Please don't bring the Festival Plaza back. Please bring something like the PSS. Something's coming at you from the tall grass. Whoa. It's a young goose. Look at the cutscene. I love it. Oh, hey there, buddy. <laughs> That's dope! So now do I get to pick my Pokemon? Or do I have to wait? There's Koopy. Hey there, cousin! Hang on, I know you're a Lily, right? Oh, okay, yeah, I saw you get attacked like that. Um, yeah, I got a bit of help. Looks like you did. I shouldn't expect that, yeah. I didn't think those little fellows would dash out and help a stranger, but I guess I'm ahead of myself. Welcome below the Pokemon Paradise. That's what I'm supposed to be saying. I'm Koopy, yeah, the Pokemon Professor. If you want a Pokemon to live and work together in Alola, don't you ever forget, you can go anywhere as long as you got a Pokemon in your corner. A Pokemon can be lurking, yeah, but just wait to leap out, but you'll be fine if you got a partner of your own. Hey there, let me introduce the Pokemon to help you. We got Wowwit and we got Witten and Pulpwheel. I'm not going to be choosing the same starter I did, for diversity's sake. This is grass like Pokemon Rowlet. Hello, buddy. But there's one starter I dislike the most, and I'm not choosing that. Fire type Pokemon Litten. War type Pokemon Poplio. You see, the fact of the matter is one of these Pokemon will be my first partner. Woo! Hey, this may be one I want to see. If you go and choose one you like to keep your... I get my partner already? I love them. They're doing their little animations. All right. I'd love to choose Poplio again because I love Primarina. But we're going Litten. Want to go with Fire Type Litten? Yes. Not because I love Poplio, but I don't really like Rowlet. You're so cute. It's a little kitty. I don't know where my little kitty is. I'd hold her up. Just like she's holding up. The little Litten. Please be female. Yes, it is! That's perfect! Dude, my baby girl is named Java. She's not in here right now. But she's my beautiful baby kitten. She's not a kitten at all. She's like 11 years old. She's an old cat, but she does not look old. She is beautiful. Ooh, Lin, what a fun-looking team you two are. And you have a Pokemon battles. You can, no, now you can have Pokemon battles. You're what we call a trainer. Here's a Pokeball for Litten. It's feeling nice and cozy in there. All right, let's get going up to Iki Town, Lily. Woo! Tell me, Island Kahuna. Island Kahuna? To his partner, Litten is a gift from the Kahuna, not me. Let's go show it off and say proper thank you. It may not be the only gift you get. Because you haven't heard the Kahunas are strangely strong trainers. Give up about getting a battle with one. 
I am 19 minutes into this recording. This is including the five minute bit I did at the beginning. And we've already, we've already gotten a Pokemon. Thank you for cutting out all the tutorial. I appreciate that. He does, right up here. Get lit in that ball I gave you. You're so cute. It was actually perfect that I ended up being female. That is a 1 in 8 chance, and I got lucky. Oh, now I can move again. Oh my gosh, we get Pokemon refreshed like immediately. Well, let's check out my baby girl Java. Scratch, Ember, and Growl. With a... Eh, I mean, that's not terrible. Rash isn't terrible. It's got Blaze, though. You're so cute. Alright. I'm just kind of starstruck. The entire... The entire layout is different. The sounds are different. The way things look. This is so cool. They updated so much. But so far, I don't think they've overdone anything. <clears throat> wing win, wing win, just a little more. Matthew, scratch. Oh, holy shit. I'm actually just realizing it's the 17th. It will be when this video goes up as well. Happy birthday, Jacob! Compound Fracture, go show him some love, guys. Appreciate it. It's also my sister and dad's birthday, too. <laughs> so, today's kind of a busy day birthday-wise. Anyways, do you do anything? If you haven't picked up a potion, you see on your... Oh, whatever. Okay. Thanks for the, the, the tip. Oh. How already? Are you gonna heal me? Before we fight. Hey! We're both gonna get a juicy partner, have you decided? Oh yeah, I'm how! I couldn't wait for a pick up partner, so I can't even find you myself! Oh, you're letting us so cool! Wait, you already picked a Pokemon? Sorry about that, how? Man, the accident away here, so I ended up letting a Lily choose her partner first. Fair enough, I guess it's just fate for you guys to meet. <laughs> you can choose one of- you can choose one of these two, how? I feel really bad for Poplio because he's not going to get chosen. My partner will be Rowlet, I choose you! Oh, the friend, I decided ages ago you're the one I wanted to have an adventure with. We're going to do so much awesome stuff together, just wait and see. I feel really bad for the Poplio because Poplio is my favorite. Hold on. I'm sorry, Poplio, don't judge me. I still love you the most. You better believe I will, Hal. I he, he asked. I didn't. I don't think I should say. You better take good care of Poplio, huh? You better believe I will. But then probably everyone. Time to back your balls for now. Let me and Ral out of favor to us. We're opponents on our first ever battle. Let's do it. Pre step. Let's stir Ludens up to it. Oh, thank you, Kukui. Appreciate it. Alright, I'm seriously gonna enjoy this. I love the whole intro animation thing now. And how's the animations are still the same. It's pretty cool. Alright. You ready, Java? Let's do this shit. Ember. Poor Owlet. It, actually, I didn't do as much as I thought I would. I suppose I didn't need healing. Thanks, though, Kukui. Out, rather like the flates when it get when it gets beaten. It's all puffed out, and there's just like the flate it flattens. I'm for some heat. Sorry, Rowlet. All right, I'm a I'm a pamper my widow kitty. Give me Pokemon to the living care. I know how to use Pokemon on me. You go. You can have a Pokebean, little guy. Cause that makes sense. <laughs> his actual eyes don't close, just his pupils slant. Well, it was awesome. You and Linton were both so cool. You gotta have the kind of battles where everyone has fun. You and a partner Pokemon too, you know? 
Red on a little, you and how brought the best in your partners and pull off spectacular moves. Ink down and wrap the stairs, come on! You should really take a check out Inky Town. I'm stumbling over my words because I'm so excited. Sorry, I just really want that notification to go away. Damn it. I do like how they 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 revamped the battle music. And before the next episode, I think we'll go out to the start menu, and I will um, make sure I see if I can get the lichen rock. Because I don't. I think that's how you get it. Because obviously it's a rock rough and it evolves into lichen rock. Oh man, so close to leveling up to level seven. Paralyzed heal. It's not a burn heal. I don't want to scream right now because it's literally midnight. I don't want to wake anybody up. <laughs> you know, I'd love to find a wild shiny in this playthrough. Straight up. I always do, but... Hey, Jabba Girl's level 7! Actually, I'm thinking about this. Let me know in the comments below if you want me... I have a second uh, shiny Chikorita. Because I basically had someone dupe my Chikorita after I hatched it shiny. So I have a second one that's only level one. If you want me to, if you want me to use that on the team because it's a shiny Chikorita, then let me know. Otherwise, I'll just make do with what I catch because that's how the game goes typically. I'll try to use different stuff, but we'll see if I can. And we're here. This right here's Icky Town. Sometimes when folks come to worship the Pokemon watched over Mele Mele Island. Tapako keeps them all safe and happy, see? The voice is actually like, torn up my throat, hold on. Looks like Kahuna's nowhere to be found though. I guess there must be trouble on the island it's fixing, yeah? Yeah, Kahuna wanted off without a word, then anybody singing a little ditty or something. I'm gonna step at home, I'm gonna show my mama Rowlet. Oh, how lives in Inky Town? I didn't know that. Hey, you got an idea for you. If you head to the village, you can visit the ruins belonging to Chapa Coco. It's Island's Deity. Yeah, why don't you go ahead and introduce yourself? If you're really lucky, maybe actually get a glimpse of the Guardian Deity yourself. Stick around and wait to see the Kunums comes back. That's interesting. They want us to go directly there. There's... What is that? That's not a TM. What is that? I'm pretty sure every bit of text I've already, I've read, is literally, I mean, I haven't been speaking out loud. I've been reading it to myself, because I'm pretty sure it's exactly the same as what was in the first game. Okay, um, I didn't even get the chance to talk to him, I just walked up to him and he started talking to me, and then he just, it just kicked me out. Kuna is the strongest Pokemon turn all in, and there's trouble going down somewhere, he needs Kuna's touch because he said something about how it's time for old Hala, and off he went. And it just does that. That's really weird. I just want to talk to everyone, because when I don't forget to save, yeah, yeah, yeah. Kuna gives wisdom and guidance. Whoa! Is this what Mahalo Trail looked like? In the last game, did we actually... Yeah, we did get the chance, because I remember smashing rocks up here. Or was that... That might have been... The demo. That we smashed rocks. I know I'll take you to the ruins. Please stay in the bag. We'll get in trouble if anyone sees you. I still, I still like giving her that whiny voice. She's still one of my least favorite po characters in all of Pokemon. So is it going to be the whole event where... Cosmog is going to get attacked by the... Spearow? Yeah, there's still Spearow. They should have made a Murkrow, this being Ultra Moon. Or this just being Ultra Sun, Ultra Moon, rather than just the originals. Spear's boring. Or why not pick a pack? Hey, Lily. Huh? Um, what's wrong? H help! Save Nebby! Spearow attacking them. I'm not a trainer. I can't. This time, we didn't have a Pokemon last time we fought them. Please save Nebby. Oh, you're a Pokemon. Thanks. Let's do it. Do I actually get to fight them this time? That's actually pretty cool. We get to fight the Spearow. Last time, they just 
We didn't have a Pokemon when we encountered the Spearow. Alright, first one's down. Good, stay. It's late, so I'm tired, and I'm yawning. Man, to save off the Spearow, but oh, there's still more. Please help me, be careful. Looks like attack may have damaged the bridge. Of course it did. Are we actually going to be fighting them, or are they just going to... Now there's three of them again? I just knocked one out. Come on, we don't need to do that. Literally send out Litten and just attack the, the Spearow. Hello, Tapakoko. It's the same cutscene again. Peace, dude. All right. Oh, thank goodness you tried using your power, didn't you? Nebby, you know what happened last time. You couldn't move for ages after that. I don't want to see you like that again. I shouldn't say that. I'm sorry, Nebby. You know you are trying to save me that time, and I couldn't help you in return. Well, what is that? So it's literally the same so far, except we just get our Pokemon earlier. Spreading soon, it feels almost warm. Please forgive me. I'm so grateful to help us out of the dangerous spot. Uh, who are you? I I'm Lily, and I'm supposed this stone must belong to you. Okay. This time it's black. Was it black last time? I feel like it was white last time. Please, don't tell anyone about seeing Nebby. It's a secret, okay? Come on, into the bag, Nebby. Um, I'm worried you might get attacked, but I know it's too much asking to see us back to town. Sure. Let's go. Yeah, that was... Why was it necessary to make that door sound? Like, we're not actually walking in the trail. It just takes us directly back to town. Oh, Lily, you already met Lily, huh? She's my assistant, yeah! Lily, I thought you were the Kahuna. With the Kahuna. Kahuna Holly City Sunday 10, so she left... Wow. Left town on his own. I was just taking a stroll on the hollow trail when I waited. And that's how you met her. And that's how you met our new neighbor, Lily, huh? She's got the Lily yesterday. Haven't found her way around yet. She's one of the press's acquaintances. It's nice to meet you. Does she actually know what she's doing this time? Kuna's back. Kuna has a return of guardian, chosen one, blah, blah, blah. Have I missed something? They are gonna holler. Was there some kind of trouble? I was gonna come in the middle of some brawling rock rough, that's all. So, Lily, what were you saying before? The reason I thought that I, I saw a top of Goku flying about. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna holler. Nimby got attacked a spear on the plank bridge. And Lily here to help protect it. The bridge collapsed, and I thought both of them might fall in the bottom of the ravine. That's when Nylon's guardian deity swooped in to save them. Well, it's seeming you're here every day. Oh, is it said to protect us? Our Tapu is rather fickle. Yet our guardian has moved to save you. Kuku, my boy, I think we have cause to celebrate. I got a brave, brave, kind new trainer Pokemon in our midst. Whatever. <laughs> I'm glad to meet you, child. I'm Hal, the Kuku of Minamata Island. Welcome to Alola. Young Kuku told me of your coming. I'm glad to be the chance to meet today. Pew! Oh, when did you get out again? No, the Kuku not only professes to keep you safe, but you should stay in the bag and not to say it's safer that way. Nebby, well, it seems they've taken liking to you. I read Pokemon like you when you pet them or can take care of them, you know? Like Pokemon to me. Alright, it's a lovely gift for me to help make today special, Lilia. Just what? The Dex. Everything is happening so fast. Pokemon's a real high tech kind of tool, yeah. They're not making record facts about any Pokemon you meet. You part of Luna's already registered. Oh, yeah, check it out. Pokeballs? No, trainer passport. Okay. 
That's just your ID and whatnot. You gotta meet the goon already head home now? Maybe. This has been an- oh my gosh. It's been an interesting, uh, few events. Oh yeah, Lily, hold up a sec! What's up, pal? What is it? How did you forget something? You're seriously asking me that? Who's the one here who forgot to tell anyone for running off for a little stroll and sing without a word, huh? Hmm, Alilia, would you be so kind as to give me a look at that stone you have there? Couldn't it be? Tutu, isn't that... You risked my temple cook on the bridge, is that what I heard? Uh, yeah. It rescued me. Even if it deigned you to give you a stone, whatever. Perhaps you are here... You are here in Alola because this is where you're meant to be. Let me to borrow the stone for now. If I'm not, I'll return it tomorrow evening. You have the making to bring and train. I can see the light within you too. You must be the honor of joining in our festival tomorrow. Press to make sure you get back home safely. Lily, you should come with us too, yeah. When I go losing twice in one day, you were that precious Pokemon. Yes, Lily, keep an eye on. I will keep an eye on. Good job there, Lily. Oh, you not tight this game the moment you were very, uh, very moment you're told not to wander off. Shit, I can't speak today. I'm reading too quickly. <coughs> Welcome back, Lily. And what do you think of Kahuna Hala? Oh, look what you got with you. Came running to help you. What a sweet little thing. That's right there on Route One. See, that's amazing. It's been fate you met. So you look great. I feel happier looking at the pair of you. That's how cats get along. Cats, my cats don't get along. They bully each other. And then half of them are fat. What a stunning sunset. All right, the day's, today's the day I finally unpack. What's was that the doorbell? Go see who it is. I mean, I think we very much probably know who it is. It's Cuckoo, right? Yep. Same as last time. Hey, how about us head outside with the festival? I guess I'm gonna show you now you're retreating. It's the most basic of all basics. Come on to Route 1. Are you gonna really show us how to catch Pokemon again? Have fun in the festival, sweetie. It's you have a good time with your new pal. Me and me will be sure to unpack every last box here. Unpack. Jeez, um. Me. If this is just the catching tutorial, I'm just I'm literally gonna cut through it because it's not a big deal. The bottom screen looks like a beast ball. I just thought I'd point that out because I didn't realize it until now. All right, got myself a grubbin. What well, I'm gonna do? Attack people to get close, catch them, and join your team at Gray Hill. They both might get all tired and you always head out and rest. But yeah, here's a book about some potions to get you started. Why don't you be a little adventure in your own on the way to Icky Town? Take good care of Lily, you litten. Okay, I think it's gonna be like first encounter is a pick a pack or something like that. It's like always a pick a pack. And a route one, it's a hundred percent catch ratio. It's a grubbin. Very cool. Did I use a Vicavolt? Yeah, and I remember I had Jad evolve it early for me. Alright, we'll throw a ball at it. Because it should be one hundred percent catch ratio. So might as well just catch it if I end up wanting to use it, which I don't know if I will because I did use a Vicable. So I'm gonna I'm gonna try to use Pokemon that I didn't, but I may have to use a Mudsdale because I absolutely adore Mudsdale. It's like my favorite Pokemon. Welcome back, Ravager Junior. I have you, whether or not I use you or not. He's got Vice Grip and String Shot with a Quiet Nature, which is actually really good. So that's pretty dope. It's not good until it becomes a Vicable, but it's good then. Its speed is abysmal, but its special attack is off the charts. Hey, I just got the Pokemon I use. Let's see what other things I could find here. What? I'm not gonna lie, that seems like the weirdest thing to find here. I mean, I love that it's a Route 1 Pokemon. I love that. Because I'd love to use one. I'd prefer to have a female one. 
Because I feel like Lopin is a more feminine Pokemon, and that's how it was made to be. Finally, I found another Baneri. This is definitely the rare encounter, and I got really lucky, and it is female immediately, so that is very nice. Alright. I mean, it's it doesn't really make that much of a difference, but it's just... I don't know. I don't even know what I want to name it, man. I mean, I kind of feel like the be the good the best name for it is Lola. No, I have a better name, Judy. I didn't really watch Looney Tunes a lot when I was a kid, but I had to see had to watch Zootopia way too many times. So, yeah, now we have Judy the the Baneri, who is my entire team is female. <laughs> I'm not gonna be using Ravager Junior because he is. Uh, I forgot you have to drag and drop, and I really dislike that. Okay, so you're lonely nature. That does suck with Runaway and, uh... I said lonely, I meant bold. Lonely would have been good. I mean, I don't really care. I'm excited to use a Baneri because I have not used one. It's gonna be my first uh, battle with a trainer, and I'm just gonna do switch training for my Baneri. Nice as trainers meet, you know what's gonna happen? A battle. Last time it was actually a uh, little youngster. A trainer music redesign is dope. I love it. Buneary versus Buneary. I actually may be able to do this myself. Might be a speed tie. I guess it kind of depends on its nature. This Buneary literally used everything it had in a row. It's just it's just kind of funny because the like straight up the animations in this are so quick too. So it's like, I'm not waiting so long to get through everything now. It's really nice. Your Pokemon looks so happy they've won. Well, that's good, because I need this Pokemon to be happy, because I'm pretty sure Baneary evolves to happiness. If only Pokemon followed you, though. That would be literally the icing on the cake. Probably make these the best Pokemon games ever. Actually, I actually have no idea if it's going to be any good later on. Hey, I found the potion that I literally just used on my Baneary. <laughs> Alright, let's do it, dude. Go for Caterpie Shimmer, the power of bug types. Alright, Judy, good job. It's a 3 co on that Caterpie. And there we go. Judy beats the Caterpie by herself. I fought a Lediba, um, just randomly off screen while I was going to get that potion, so it was, uh, that was the reason that Judy had enough experience to level up. Baneri's so cute, dude. I actually really like it. Baneri really likes the left ear to be touched, but not this one. I like it. I, I don't know. Baneri is such an adorable Pokemon, man. If only they were better. If only they were actually fighting type before they mega, before it Mega Evolved. And I actually really would love to get the Lopinite, and I don't know when I can use the Mega Ring. Rockruff staring at you. What would you like to do? Stare at it. Rockruff is staring at you. What would you like to do? Turn to the right. <laughs> Wait, what? This, that's cute. Rockoff seems to play more. What would you like to do? Play peekaboo? Oh, I have to click A. <laughs> Look how cute the little Rockoff is. I like that. I like that. You follow me around, little buddy? What are you doing? I like that. That's cute. Oh, this will is gonna start with your ramp and go. Well, I like. I actually wanted to fight you, but sure. There's one more trainer, isn't there? Yeah, there's this dude. Hey, please battle me. Okay, my Benira needs more training before we fight. How anyway? I still wish you could get that Vicavolt shirt. Maybe you can. I just don't know where to get it. I'll probably pay as a male in Ultra Sun, and maybe I'll be able to get it someplace. This might hurt if it has Hustle, which it might. I did a lot of damage. I Actually, never mind. I suppose Rattata has Stab when it comes to that, because it's a normal Dark type. If you're strong, please go away. <laughs> Sorry, buddy. Okay, before I go, I'm literally going to go heal back in my, my house, because I think I can heal there. Whoever those people are, I, I lost my train of thought. I don't want to die. 
Even though this is a Nuzlocke, I don't want to get knocked out. As I walked in here, I realized that I... I just remembered the name that I wanted to give the Baneri, and I had forgotten it, and I was thinking... Okay, thank you. Alright, peace, Mom. Um, I, I just remembered the name I wanted to give the Baneri, and I had forgotten it, so I just like, you know what, let's go with, uh... Whatever I called it. <laughs> let's go with Judy. Because uh, it's, a, it's a name that works, because it's a female bunny. And the name raider isn't until Akala Island, either. Unless they decided to move that, which would be nice. Otherwise, I can deal with Judy. Because it's not a bad name. It's just not the name I was... Originally thinking. That's really cool, of playing with the rock of. Anyway, who are you? Imagine the are readings here. Numbers appear to be a bit high. Hey, what do you think, Captain? Hey, Vegeta. I'm gonna make the Captain nap Nappa. Hey, what was that? Did you say something? I was, well, I was just... Sir, hey, Vegeta, hey, Vegeta, I was certainly not distracted by this foolish display of festivity. Not all our readings in this place. Perhaps it may be the effects of that one they call the Kahuna, Vegeta. Everything's so bright here in Alola. For brighter than we had told it, we have found it loathsome, this awful brightness. Even though the light we've sought for so long? Yes, I suppose you're right, Vegeta. We must carry out our investigations to turn the light to our own world as well, for the blinding one can awaken. What? The blinding one? I actually kind of like their their outfits, though. They remind me of New Team Plasma. You. You. You're not named Galula either, are you? You seem to come far away. Okay. Is it my clothes? They had this weird electricity sound in their music. That's interesting. Anyway. Let's do it. I have a level 6... Almost level 6 Baneri. Holy cow, there's a giant Exeggutor! Whoa! Hey, Hala. A little region is made up of four items, each item is its own guardian. Festival is an express of these great Pokemon for many by our sites. We call it festivals, this is a little thing you see. May not be many of us, at least everyone goes all out. You ready to do this, dude? You had two Pokemon last time. Or in the original games when we at this part, so. Yo, how's it, Lily? Man, I've never thought you'd make it mean I've been waiting for ages. Hold on, didn't I explain to you about tonight? No. Oh yeah, right at time. What's exactly? Full power festival battling. We in the name of Tapako, the Pinder Bennett best moves against one another, friendly competition. Woo! Sure. You to be taking part? I don't like seeing Pokemon fight since they have to get hurt, but I'll watch you both. Your Pokemon are fought for you, so I'll show the same count return. Let me heal him. Alright, I guess I didn't need to go back. I was afraid of battling those people. Are you ready for this battle? Yeah, let's do it. I have a level 6, almost level 6 Baneri, and a level 8 Litten. I should be good. I think his first Pokemon last time was a Pichu. For life and items! And also undertake the island charge to join the huts. We give you protection for them and all mele mele. But this Pokemon better be offering to our guardian's deity, Tapu Koko. For you send how sons how grandson to the Kuhuna. Let's have fun with this rowlet. Before him sends Olivia, one who is met with Tapu Koko. What? What a curious thing Tapu Koko is. That's just typical of it. Beniri, take care of my little Lilia. As long as we both have a good time, we can call it a great battle, eh? Eh? Oh, Lily, how bring forth power your Pokemon! Alright, let's do it, my dude. They should have done a little bit of revamp revamping the house theme. It's not bad, but they revamped the trainer battle and the wild battle theme, so they should have just added something. Yeah, it is a Pichu still. Alright, level 6. Yeah, it's only a Pichu as well. I don't even know if it has Thundershock at this level. You're gonna go for Charm. Well, that just downright sucks. <laughs> ah. And there goes- Oh, look at that! The ability thing! That is so cool. Alright, hang in there, Judy. Come on. Just two more pounds and this thing is dead. Thundershock. How much will that do? I did a little more than I expected to do, actually. A critical hit will knock it out if you could do that, Judy. Well, it would have, I mean. Just hit it. There we go. Good job, Judy. Proud of you. 
Judy's gonna level up, which is very nice. And I'm gonna leave it in and swap into my Litten so I can get some XP. Endure, not bad. I'll never use Splash because Splash is literally worthless. I mean, Z Splash isn't bad. Maybe I shouldn't have got rid of it, but who cares? And Relic's only level 7. Okay. I didn't actually expect that. Oh, will job would get up to level 8 because I thought it would actually be around there. Alright, Ember does about half your health. So one more should take you out, theoretically. I think Tackle and Leafage did about the same amount of damage. Which is weird because Leafage is resisted. Unless Tackle's only base 30 in this game. Sweet. Jabba grew to level 9 and Judy grew to level 7. Nice. It's already over? Yeah, it is. Good job, team. Oh, you? I thought it was going to be Baneri, because Baneri's the one who needs care. Hooey, another great battle this year. I bet Top Coco liked it, too. That was awesome, Alilia. That was a really great battle. I had a blast fighting you. I mean, it really wasn't that great. It was a good battle with this even Top Coco. And there's Coco. Oh, you heard yourself Top Coco's song of approval. Only if I forgot this time you take this, Alilia. It is black this time. That is actually really cool. Your Z power ring and mysterious I'm going to draw out the power lies deep within Pokemon. It being for the Z power. We can always make Z power rings use stones like sparkling stones you receive from Coco. Do you need to undergo the item challenge to collect Z crystals? If you use to draw forth Pokemon Z power. Now you've already received that sparkling stone. Seems to have a Coco took quite a liking to you. Perhaps there's a mission for you. It's time you get out. It's time you get out and start your other challenge. This is every island maybe figure out what the mission is. Every island? Four islands! Traffic each of four islands here in a little region! Island trader, but I mean to be the strongest trainer. Island challenge champion, woo! Sounds great, but I can't wait to have a real adventure. I'll let Kuna, I'll explain the details. I don't trust Kuna, we spoke of. The journey to overcome your own limitations, you travel across the far corners of Alola, meet the others along the path. It's a great adventure that children in the Alola region buck on, along with the Pokemon once they reach 11 years of age. Let me both give you all and challenge me that's what we need. Awesome, thanks you two. I'm gonna make it to the Iron Challenge become the Iron Challenge Champion. This one is for you as well, Olivia. Please do give it a, a try. I don't really have a choice. I can't do anything else if I don't. Yeah, it's the only choice. Best way to get into a Lola. Alright, can we be done with the cutscene? I'd actually like to end this episode. This is a long ass recording. Tapu Koko is amazing, isn't it? Hope we meet it again. Thank you for saving Nebby. Oh, yeah? You know, Lily, it did save your life, too. And even gift you that sparkling stone, even though you're a stranger. I suppose it's time to get your kids home, yeah? Nebby, I have Lily as fun all kinds of wonders, isn't it? Alright. Peace, nerd. Captain was able to take title of Zora at this full-powered festival. Hey, Vegeta, I suppose you would. According to your research, it seems that the Z-powering as type of Goku creature be in a great deal of light, Vegeta. A little bit of light, though, released by the blind one. I found myself rather envious, Vegeta. I wonder if we can find another way to use the great power to fill the Lola for ourselves. As plastic might be here, the Ultra Recon Squad are here to make clear, Vegeta. Honor, there's not much a little we have not seen as we get it all, Vegeta. The Ultra Recon Squad. Who the hell are they? Honey, I'm home. I think I should be saying that, Mom. Well, no, wait, never mind, that doesn't make sense. Oh, Lily, you're back already? I thought you want to stay in Nikki Town longer. You didn't come. Cry. Actually, I forgot. Yet, yeah, yeah, Yes, you did. Especially after the battle, I was kept up messy my own girl fighting in such perfect sync with a partner. Maybe a good idea for try the Allen Challenge thing. It's something you can only do in Lola, right? Right now, I gotta deep my bed. I dance my feet off at that festival. Night, night, you get some sleep, too. Alright, will do. I like. I wanted to pause at the Grubbin. I just don't know if I'm going to get to the Pokemon Center right yet, or if I'm going to have to go down and meet Kukui again. We did, That's when we got the Pokedex the first time. But What beautiful weather. I wonder what today will bring me. A visitor. If it's Kukui, probably let himself in without waiting for us to open the door. It's how, I'm pretty sure. This time. Because he says that, but I mean, Kukui only did that once. This time. He did it twice in the first game. Oh, it's Lily. What's up, Lily? 
Oh, um, Professor said, Hey, Lily, bring me that great new trainer, Wu. So I'm here to show you the way of his lab, but it's, um, this way. Lilia! Sup, Mom? Here's a pocket money. What more do you- I have 5,000. That's enough for 20 Pokeballs, isn't it? More than 20 Pokeballs. Oh, well, Dana, Lily, you're making friends, aren't you? What a cute little friend you found. Hey, Lily, be a great place. We just keep meeting wonderful people here. Oh, uh, well, thank you. My name is Lily. It's very nice to meet you. Looks like it's friendly. Your time to shine, sweetie. Enjoy yourself with Baneri and don't be gone too long. Okay. You have a nice mother, don't you? Let's get going. I'll show you the research lab. You're gonna tell me to jump. Okay. You can make sure without going if you jump down the ledge, just like this. That's actually really cool that she teaches you how to do that. Because it, there was a youngster here who talked about it, how it was scary to do that. So. Hey, dude, what's up? Let's fight. Let's go, kneecaps! What? What a Pokemon to have on the first, second round of the game. An Inke. That's dope! I'm actually, re that's really cool. Alright, let's see if this pound will kill, even though it's set up a reflect. Damn it. Maybe you have to waste an extra turn, you stupid NK. NK, NK. And goodbye. NK might be a cool Pokemon to use. Alright, well, let's see what we found on this route. I was just trying to walk through the grass and get that item. Same old, same old. <laughs> an awakening. Is there a fire emblem too? Hui, hui, hui. <laughs> Little chick, I'm a cute Pokemon. What's going to be? I think it was a Luddy Bone in the first game. A Young Goose. I wouldn't say Young Goose is cute. Young Goose is one of those weird Pokemon. It's not very good. I I feel like it's my least favorite beginning, beginning rat Pokemon. Okay, can I do this? No, I can't. Okay. I love the electric guitar now in this... In these... In the, re in the redone songs. It's really nice. Alright, sweet. Whoa, his house looks different. I think. Maybe not. The, the water is green. Is it just the type of day? time of day? Yeah, bro, well, let's go. Give it everything you got. My body's ready. Woo! <laughs> there they go again. The Pokemon Reach Lab is his only charm. I've been imposing on the professor. He's an assistant. What the hell was that? Professor, you never stopped researching that email inside the lab. Looks like I have to patch the roof. Just watch the lab coat and got to clean out me in shreds. I'm no good at mending clothes. I have to buy an another new one. It's probably going for does more damage. Oh, I do have to follow you in. I was hoping I could check what was outside first. Alright, I don't know what he's going to say that's actually going to be different, if anything. So, I will probably cut to the if he says something different. Hey there, pleasure to meet you. I'm not nervous or anything, okay? Sure, I just really hope you're not as annoying as you were in the last game. This is actually what my... What my desk looks like right now. That is... Cr that's crazy. Because I only have the two monitors, one in front, one slanted here. Then my keyboard and my mouse. Uh, except I don't have a ton of boxes over here. What the heck was that? Okay, apparently my, like, drawing tablet... And Pokemon Center Spectre right next to your house. Yes, it is. Uh, what? Everything is falling into darkness. Nippy, don't worry, it's okay. It must be called the solar eclipse happens when the sun gets covered up. Solar eclipse forecast for today? This is some kind of good omen, yeah. A, so a solar eclipse doesn't happen that fast. An omen you think something good will happen? Sure, a long time to tell. I love it's going darkness. See when people in Pokemon blast all the darkness or light. They say it was why people started gathering crystals in the custom turn of the island challenge. Lilia, now you got the Z power ring. I'm gonna collect tons of Z crystals too. My throat is tickling. That's exactly what a move researcher like me needs to uncover new secrets. But that's not why she's supposed to be doing it. Come on, Lilia, show you the Pokemon Center. All right. Well, guys, I think that is where I'm going to be ending. The first episode of Pokemon Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon. I really hope you enjoyed it. Dilly appreciated. I'm excited to continue with this game. This is awesome so far. So, 
I'm 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 excited. This should be awesome. So thanks so much for watching. I'll talk to you later.